Hey guys, this is Margarito. He hasn't been able to walk for seven months after he tried to jump a ditch at work. He's been hurting so bad, he's just dying. He tried going to Mexico to see a Wasero down there. It didn't help. He went to Kaiser. They recommended surgery for him because a hernia disc had some injections. Went to a Kaiser chiropractor, was useless, took some drugs. He brought the whole family to see him get treated. We're lowering him down on the special table here. We took some x-rays. As you can see, all the arthritis, tons of it. Adjusted his neck and his back. Hey, Dr. Thayer here. Uh, one week down, one to go with this guy. And uh, his family just came in and just couldn't be more happy with how he's doing. Uh, this boy is moving and grooving and starting to shuck and jive. He can twist in bed and lay on his wife. I'm sorry. <laughs> Maybe not that. They haven't said that. They haven't shared that. But anyways, they said he can turn in bed. <laughs> well, you know, if the legs are getting stronger, maybe everything's getting stronger. And he's walking around the room. He doesn't even ask for their help anymore. He just gets up and moves. Still using the walker, but uh, not leaning at it anymore. Using very light pressure and just taking off and his confident on his own to get this work done. And uh, he's, he's doing so much, his calves are getting tight and his feet are getting swollen because he's moving so much. ¿Qué has um, aprendido toda esta semana? ¿Qué significa para ti? ¿Qué significa esta semana que ha pasado para ti? ¿Cómo has mejorado? Pues sí, bien, porque me siento con más fuerza ya, mira. Ya no aguantaba quedarme mucho parado, sí. He couldn't stand that for long periods like that. Yeah. Now he's very strong. been doing all last week or last, in last week. We're going to work on his L3 area right here where the most arthritis is in his back. And we're going to work on his atlas today. And so, um, the thing we're going to do right now, in my mind, is we're going to start pushing him a little bit more. Um, he's still a little scared to walk on his own, so I'm going to try to push him on that aspect. We're going to see where he's at today, because I haven't seen how he walks today yet. And so, uh, same adjustment, get a little deeper. Um, uh, the daughter was talking about massage, his legs too, and so we're going to probably throw that at him this week too. Um, and I'm going to see what's going to go on. I, I, I want to know what's going on. So, today, uh, L3 and Atlas. Respira profunda. Exhala. Abre la boca. Oh. There we go. There we go. Perfect. This way. Good. Come in. Okay, arms down. Jungle. Oh, my Okay, let's see if we can do uh, una manos. Una mano? That's right. Okay. One hand, guys. Slow down, slow down, slow down. Let's go. Good hand. Mm. There you go. You're doing good. You're good. Slow down. Stop, 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 stop. No cheating, no cheating. I know, exactly. There you go. <laughs> almost, almost, almost. Look at right there. <laughs> almost. Hey, that was uh, light years better than before, guys. So I'm sorry it took so long, but I wanted you guys to see. See you guys next time. Dr. Thayer here. This is Tuesday morning. He was sore after the last adjustment. So today we're going to do side posture, try to mitigate the um, push, the, the pressure on it. If I had him more long, I'd probably go a little slower here, but I want to try something else and see what happens. Um, I still think the prone adjustment is going to be better than the adjustment I'm going to give today, but this will be a little less painful. Go ahead and lay in your sides de lado, uh, and then uh, the rach is towards me. Volteado para allá de lado. This is how we're going to set you up for this one, okay? Just relax there, okay? Okay. So I'm going to set up on a C L3 here. I'm going to do a little speed move here, which will be a lot less pressure on his back. And hopefully this solves some of the soreness from his adjustment. Right here. Uh -huh. Okay, ultra lava. This side's starting to go. 
Good. Okay, hey, Boca Riva, how'd that feel, sir? ¿Cómo se sintió eso? Bien. Yeah, better than yesterday, right? Más mejor que ayer, ¿verdad? Starting to sweat on me again. Getting a little slippery. The bowling ball's getting a little slippery. Okay. Okay. Good. You didn't hear that very much, but guys, but that went. That was probably the best one we've done in two days, right there. Look at his posture. Looks good. Mm -hmm. Better than yesterday. Yeah. Sexy. It's back. Sexy's back. ¿Qué pasó en las últimas horas? Nada, pues caminamos. He walked better. Walked better? Mm -hmm. And so, uh, what about uh, pain in his back? El dolor. Sí, pues tiene como el cuatro en la cintura. I realize that I'm hurting him a little bit with this um, work I'm doing, but uh, this is, it's much deeper of a treatment, and um, I don't think it's the most important thing, but I'm doing some pumping work. I'm not really adjusting him hard now because it irritates his back, but um, he walked the best. I mean, he was almost running down the hall after I did this last time. So it's a, it's a blend of me working his nervous system and trying to get his muscles to relax. So we're gonna do it again, and he has a massage at three o'clock with um, our famous, uh, awesome, um, spectacular Rebecca, pumping the disc and creating motion in the disc. Just kidding here. Good. Okay, we're gonna move up to L3 right now. Same thing. Good. All we're doing is creating motion because uh, he moves, but he's not moving enough to create the proper motion to keep the joints moving properly. So, and up here, we're gonna get a little bit of adjustment right here, T, T, T11 here, T12. Okay, respira profunda. Exhala. Yes, you can hear that? Gotcha. So I'm gonna go down here one more time and pump. And right at L5 now. Good. And L3 one more time. Good. Perfect. And not moving for the last seven months. And all I'm doing is creating some motion here. Good. Perfect. So I'm just going to grab his SI joint here, guys. Good. Perfect. Arriba. Stay right here a second. So we work on his posture here. He goes the El Presidente walk here. So, <laughs> and so uh, we've trained him now to walk with one hand. See you guys, moving pretty darn good. Good, sir. Good. He loves his hallway. <laughs> Say goodbye. Bye. Like Bye. Bye. Right. <laughs> Spencer. Sí, he mejorado mucho y recobré las fuerzas poquito más en mis pies y pues estoy estoy más más fuerte en mis pies. He said that he's gotten a lot better these past two Look at him smile now. El Presidente. <laughs> <laughs> My people! Quisiera tener más tiempo para seguirle, pero lamentablemente vivemos muy lejos. Yeah, he said he wished he had more time to see you, but um, unfortunately yeah, yeah. we live too far. Yeah, I live too far. I didn't realize it was six hours away, so uh, Stockton. So if you see him in Stockton, people are say, hey, I know you, I seen you from the YouTube video. <laughs> ¿Cuántos porcentajes has mejorado en estas dos semanas? Como el 60%. Like 60%. Yeah. And she just told me that she used to work for a chiropractor. Thank you. Yes. Yes, yeah, for how long? Um, for about 
A year. A year, gotcha. And so he went to her chiropractor. And so I thought that was interesting because she has chiropractic experience. I didn't know this till now. And so when she's talking to me, you know, we're talking and we're just, she's helping translate, which is wonderful. But I was like, oh, well, well you've worked in a chiropractic office for a year. So what, how is this process different than working in the other office? I'm curious. What is the it difference? It's way different. His techniques are wonderful. And my, where I used to work, it wasn't nothing compared to here. Yeah, what do they used to do there? How do they used to treat the patients over there? Not, not, not personally, but how do they used to treat them technique-wise? And what kind of material, what kind of things do they do over there? It wasn't really, it was more like just, uh, in and out and it wasn't more like a one-on-one -on -one patient and you I realized that you take your time to talk to the patients versus just like being in here and rushing them out. I appreciate that. Otra cosa más que quieres decirle? No, si le estoy muy agradecido con él. Yeah, that he really appreciates everything yeah. you've done for him. I appreciate him too. I love these cases because again my videos bring people like this to my office where they have no recourse except some schmo medical hack trying to cut them open and do surgery on them. And now he's 60% better. He has a chance to live a life again. And it's because of the videos, because of YouTube. So um, I thank YouTube for the opportunity to let people like this watch my stuff. Did you cry? <laughs> I'm like, what? I'm it's like, man, I'm, I'm making Elizabeth cry. I'm doing good. <laughs> <laughs> and we're just going to get in here and do a speed move here. Contact L5 Spinus here. You guys can listen. Hmm? Good, perfect. Okay, so listen, guys. Okay, right here, L5. Okay, good, perfect. Okay, respira profunda. Okay, abre la boca, abre la boca. Beautiful. That's it, Maurice. Keep going. Let's see if we can do the whole thing. You see, this is the reason why I'm going to recommend him to more of the people over there in Stockton. Who's that? Oh, my, oh me, you yeah, mean? Yeah, oh. you. Look at him. We'll stop right here at the end. Good. Okay. Thank you so much, sir. Thank you. Thank you very much. Yes. Good. See you guys.